Oh. Hey everybody. So, I just discovered fucking spaghetti squash, okay? Now, I was looking at recipes. Oops, crap. Sorry, I was trying to get my fork. Um, so this is spaghetti squash. That's cheese, by the way. This, this is cheese. Mozzarella cheese. But, um, I put Alfredo sauce. And quite a bit of salt, honestly, to kind of um, balance out the sweetness of the spaghetti squash, but the spaghetti squash texture really amazed me because it is exactly like like an angel hair, al dente angel hair or vermicelli or whatever pasta. Like literally. I could eat this as a substitute for pasta forever. Now, I'm not just playing, because I've tried like the shiitake mushroom noodles. They didn't really taste like noodles. This tastes like noodles, okay? This, the texture, they don't call it spaghetti squash for no reason. It is noodle-like. All you gotta do is bake it at like 400 for an hour. You gotta cut it in half, bake it, and then you pull apart the fibers and it looks exactly like noodles. Now they're short noodles, but at the end of the day, I don't give a fuck. Tastes like I'm eating a bowl of that like box pasta, except better. But like honestly, you know how they, in the box pasta, they have like the really skinny, tiny noodles. That's the one. So I put a tad of uh, garlic powder, just a tad, just like this much. And I put a tad of like onion powder. I put a lot of pepper and a lot of salt. And some Alfredo sauce, like the um, Great Value brand, $1.89 one, um, the four cheese. And then I put some mozzarella. That's just fire. Oh yeah, and I put a little lemon juice. You don't have to do that. It don't matter. But anyway. I am amazed. Like. Why? How? I don't understand. So. If you eat a plain. It does have a sweetness to it. Like a pumpkin-y. I mean it is a squash. But. If you balance it out with salt. She not tastes like fucking noodles. Like right now, I feel like I'm eating noodles. So, sorry y'all. Ow, it burns. I got some barbecue brisket because, I don't know, because I'm hungry. <laughs> Why else will we be eating? everybody. Plus, I'm pregnant. I need to be eating. So, today for breakfast, I had, what I have? An apple, and then I had a smoothie bowl, and then I have, what else did I have? A banana. And I didn't eat all day, so now I'm hungry. So, this is barbecue brisket. This was like $11 at Walmart. That was kind of ridiculous, but whatever. I'm so hungry, like... I don't understand myself. Oh, this uh, kind of reminds me of Golden Corral a little bit. That's what the brisket looked like. I mean, it's good. I don't know if it's worth eleven dollars, but it's good. Good for a quick dinner. If you're lazy, like me. Look at the fucking string pull. Oh, bitch. Oh, bitch. That's what it looks like. Don't that look like noodles, bitch? It tastes like noodles, too. Spaghetti squash. It had a seed in it. So you're supposed to take out all the seeds. I was lazy last night. 
I didn't do that. I took out most of them. So, you know, if you do it right, you, you won't have any seeds, so I won't worry about that. It tastes like noodles. I literally am stunned. How? I've always wanted a noodle substitute. And I saw this girl on Facebook. She was like, spaghetti squash. And I was like, spaghetti squash. Girl, let me tell you. That shit tastes like noodles. If you put the right stuff on it. Straight up tastes like noodles. <clears throat> I'm sorry. This is a miracle. I'm sitting here eating about half of it. I mean, it makes two two bowls full. Crisp spaghetti squash, so, you know. Oh, man. Takes longer than noodles, but still. This spaghetti squash. I'm still like, wow, what the fuck? Everybody, if you want an alternative to noodles, this is it. Not that fucking shirataki shit. That's okay, but I would don't. I wouldn't want to eat it every week. Maybe like once or twice a year. Maybe once a year. This I could eat every week. Every few weeks. Bro. Fire. <gasps> I'm not joking. This is so good. Like, you know. I'm so glad I tried this because now I know. You know. And yeah, like I said. To balance out the sweetness of the spaghetti squash, you really have to put some seasoning on it. But, it's so good, everybody. Holy shit. I can't believe it. I really can't. I could eat another bowl of that, but I'm not going to right now, this moment. But maybe another moment in the five, five minutes. I'm just kidding. So this brisket's okay. I don't think I'll buy it again. Unless I'm in a real rush. Then maybe. But for eleven dollars for this? I don't know. I think I'm done with that for now. So everybody. I got another, like, this much. The, see? I didn't even eat half of it. I lied. But, um, the cheese's starting to get hard because it's been on the stove cold a little bit. But, I mean, it's still warm. Don't get me wrong. But you know how mozzarella is. Mozzarella ain't the fella. This shit is so good. The texture, dude. It's like those super thin noodles that you get from the box. And I like those, so. Look. It's hard to see it. That's what it looks like. Don't that look like fucking noodles? It does, especially if you're, especially if you try it in real life, you'll really see it. So you need to try this, like literally. 
This is so good. I'm getting full. This, I'm gonna make this again. Wow. I am like, wow. Wow. How? I don't know. Oh, God, I'm full. <clears throat> Holy shit. I'm gonna keep eating, though. I'm, like, bending over, and it hurts. This is nuts. I'm still trying to understand. Because the texture tastes like al dente noodles. I don't understand. How is that even possible? Why didn't anybody tell me about this? This is my savior. Holy shit. <clears throat> I'm gonna eat it all, honestly. This is fucking good. I did not think this would be good. When I first, you know, thought about doing it. I, I didn't even think I would use my spaghetti squash. But uh, I did, and I'm very happy that I found out the magic of spaghetti squash. I left some cheese at the bottom, but that's it, everybody. That was magical. Spaghetti squash for the win. So everyone go try some spaghetti squash. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye-bye. Okay, everybody, I lied. So we're going to eat dessert. Um, so this is an immunity bowl that I got from Walmart. I got the passion fruit mango pineapple one. Um, honestly, I tasted my spoon and it tastes really good. So I put the packet of granola on there already. But uh, this one comes in a plastic tub. The other one came in like this weird cardboard one. I didn't really like the texture. I, I don't know what it is, but if, if I have to have cardboard around me, I just don't really like it. But anyway, this is dessert. Um, so it's not really thawed yet, but I don't really want it too thawed really. I honestly don't even think this needs granola. Just this fruit part is good. Yeah. But I put, I tried um, actual passion fruit the other day. It was really good. It's a really seedy, small fruit. You know, you eat the seeds and they're sour. They're tangy. They're good. It's kind of orange in the middle. Strongly suggest trying it. I'd say it's about one of the most delicious fruits I've ever had. Um, rambutan or whatever. Rambutan. It's like the spiked, hairy, purple looking fruit. Like this big. I think it's related to lychee. That one's also really good. Hmm. I think they had it at Meyer or Walmart. Surprisingly. That one's also another good one. 
I'm not gonna lie, this shit is really good. Not gonna lie, in the car, I had some Takis. Like a, a bag of Takis. Like, not a family bag, but like, one of the like dollar, two dollar bags, you know. You get a Walmart on the side aisle right before you leave. That one. That's really good. Because this girl at work, she was like, mm, I want some Takis. And I was like, girl, I know I want Takis. So then I went and got Takis after work. That's what you get. Takis. I'm about to just eat the granola alone. Because honestly, I don't need it. Um, I still want to eat what I paid for. Don't get me wrong. This shit was almost $5 for some fucking reason. It's good. Don't get me wrong. It's really good. Better than the other brand. With a cardboard, in my opinion. A lot better. This one tastes good. I think this one tastes more fresh than the other one. For some reason. Maybe it's because I'm plastic, not, not cardboard or something. You know? Anyway. I don't even know. If I can finish this just because like I kinda wanna save some for tomorrow. I'm trying to get that granola off there so it doesn't get soggy overnight. Cause I don't like soggy granola. It's gross. <clears throat> Let me eat half. That's good enough. Yeah, this one tastes much more fresh than the other one. I don't know why, but I guess they're just better. But yeah, <clears throat> that's the end of my video. See y'all in the next one. Bye-bye.